come with a carry bag, with a monitor mount, with a 12 foot RCA monitor cable, and with a light microphone mount that goes in the front over the camera. It also comes with two clamps and with a weight caddy. The weights are optional. We will supply the weights if you want them. Any sturdy tripod will work with the Cummings Crane 85 or 121. A Manfrotto 028 or a Manfrotto 117 or models that I've used and felt were good with the crane. What one needs to watch for when putting the crane on top of the tripod is that you don't cross thread or put on the spindle handle too tight when fastening it to the top of the tripod. One can either extend the, the camera extension or the, the counterbalance weight extension. It's really a, a matter of preference, personal preference, and there is no set procedure that you have to follow. On this particular video, I've extended the, the camera extension, I've squared up the supports, locked it off on both the extension tightener and also on the fixed arm for the tilt control. On the weight extension, I've added the handles at the very last side positions. When you do add, a, add the uh, weight handles, be sure to thread them all the way through and put them on as tight as you can by hand. The best way to install your camera is to tilt your camera mount. Then first of all, screw in the set screw to the bottom of your camera and then use the thumb screw to tighten it against the camera mount. Once you've got it on good and tight, we can now put the weights in place. Every crane comes with a weight caddy that will hold three 10 pound barbell plates. If you're buying a 121 and you're going to have something like a seven or eight pound camera, you may want to buy uh, a, a additional weights you probably will want another 10 maybe even another 15 pounds to counterbalance if you want a, an extra weight caddy you can order one as well to get smooth craning motions it's best to balance the crane and the easiest way to do that is to put the weights on and then move either fore or aft the weight bar until you find a nice balance then lock it off with the the tightener use the supplied clamps to secure your weights then if you're going to use an LCD monitor this is a good time to put it on it's pretty easy to, to figure out which end goes into the side of the yoke for the crane for the monitor mount is a 5 16 inch thumb screw. Add your LCD monitor and then you can make your adjustments. You can tilt the monitor mount and you can also turn your monitor. You might also want to use a larger monitor and position it either beside the tripod or under the tripod tilting it up so that you got easy view of it. Supplied with the crane is a 12 foot RCA monitor cable. Once you've got your monitor and your camera plugged in and you're powered up, you're pretty well ready to go. You'll find you'll need to do some practicing in order to be able to crane, pan, tilt the camera all at the same time. You'll find that using Tai Chi type movements will help in getting smoother moves, especially when you're you're craning and tilting at the same time.